Hi, I'm Mrs. Franklin Oconqua, and I'm here to talk about some of the activities we've been doing for our biomes for our GPS standard in the state of Georgia. Um, we have two activities where students had to find the key characteristics on ecosystems and biomes. This is known as our biome wheel, and what they have to do is find key characteristics of all the biomes that we've talked about in class. And they choose a color, and the color, whenever they match up their biome, they'll have information for temperature, the key characteristics as far as precipitation, and then they also have the plants and animals listed. This is a system on the CRCT for when the CRCT gives them specific questions like um, if they were in the tundra and saw permafrost or elk or something like that, they can easily identify, oh, that's tundra. So that's one of the th activities that we've been working on in our ecosystem portion of our standard. And another thing we've been working on is with symbiotic relationships. And here we have a symbiotic pyramid where they draw a picture first of a relationship like mutualism. They put the definition in their own terms. And we have mutualism, commensalism, parasitism, and then two more, which will be competition and predator and prey. Whatever it takes for them to totally understand what that relationship means in their own terms, that's their goal. So when they see it on a CRCT, once again, they're able to identify it. So just some of the cool things that we do in seventh grade to make sure our kids and our students are ready for the CRCT. Okay. And you're at Youth Middle School? Youth Middle School. And if anybody wants copies of these, they can just email Owen Ogletree and I will get them to them. Okay? Yes, sir. All right. Thank you very much. Thank you.